Every Wednesday morning, these neighbors gather in sunny Lawson Park. Some have lived here for decades. I've been in this neighborhood for uh, 26 years. Others, a couple of years. I've been in this area about two years. Regardless of when they arrived or how they now live, this is their community. I really want to see it um, be a place that everyone feels welcome. Each week, John Hayden volunteers with the Five Points Housing Outreach Team. The group cleans up the park and works in the gardens. Volunteers also form relationships with neighbors. Neighbors like Joseph, who lives in the encampment nearby. Because we are part of the community, no matter which way you look at it, we are part of your community. Jeff Baker may be president of Curtis Park Neighbors, but he's not trained in outreach. No one here is. Still, they found some success in helping Joseph and others who live here. The group that was out here, um, I think them, because they're including us as part of the community, that's what we want. The goal is to connect them with the services they need, whether that be housing or just everyday items. The usual water, some of the neighbors bring food. So this isn't about get out of our neighborhood. In fact, the longer they stay in one place, the more success John and Jeff ultimately have. Sweeps tend to result in people like Joseph losing contact with trained outreach providers. That's a breakdown in the system of trying to move people into housing and to get them off the streets. A breakdown Jeff and others here are trying to help fix one Wednesday morning at a time. Ali Levine, 9 News. The city of Denver does provide outreach and services to those living in camps. The Five Points Housing Outreach Team supports a city sanctioned campsite in their neighborhood. They see it as a temporary solution to connect people experiencing homelessness with the resources that they do need.